Man, that ray of sunshine there was, their light was getting in the way. <clears throat> All right, let's talk about um, 75 hardware I'm at, what I'm doing. Um, I did take a little bit of time off. I had uh, probably about 15, 20 chocolate chip cookies. Um, I had cheeseburgers, fries, not cheeseburgers, a cheeseburger and fry. Um, I really didn't do much else. I've been tracking my macros all but those couple days. Uh, still drinking my gallon of water, working out twice a day, getting my calories and proteins, my snatch cookie every now and then. I'm not doing 75 hard, but I'm, you know, the diet and stuff still there, the workout's still there, the water's still there, still reading book. Uh, current book is Relentless. I know it's backwards by Tim Grover. It's a pretty good book. Uh, Michael Jordan, Coach K, Dwayne Wade, Pat Riley, Charles Barkley. Uh, a lot of guys that he talks about in it, so that's really cool. Uh, I've also got three people that is currently doing 75 hard. I'm not having them do it, just talking to them about it. They decided to do it. Um, and so I'm kind of helping them any way I can, possible, whatever it takes. Uh, so far, they're doing good. I think a couple of them are on day three or four, and one, the other one is on probably like day seven or eight. Um, you know, one's already quit and started back up. It just happens, man. You can't do too much. You know, take a pace, marathon, another sprint. Um, you know, if, you're, if your workout started out as a 45 minute, walk on a treadmill and a 45 minute walk outside so be it that's fine it's not a big deal you know getting a good diet uh, drinking your waters yeah you're gonna have to go to the bathroom a lot that's given especially if you're 43 like me i don't feel like i drink as much water as it comes out of me but you know it is what it is um it's just part of it the diet's good the workouts good the book reading is good um so keep you know we can do that easy so you know, just kind of giving you an update on 75 hard words at my life. I'm still living the lifestyle, still doing most of the things, helping a couple people uh, move through it. Um, me and my son and, and another friend of mine are all finished with it. I will do it again, and I plan on doing phase one and two uh, here towards the end of the year. Or I may not, but I will do 75 hard again next year at this time, so January 4th. And I know, actually, I forgot, I know some other people that are doing it. it had nothing to do with me, but it was a group of, I think there was six, and now there's four of them. Um, and they're doing it too, so it's kind of a it's a kind of a trend around here. So that's cool. Um, it's good seeing people do it, and they all say it's hard, which it is. So that's kind of part of it. But you know, once you do it, the relief of doing it, knowing you've done it, you're really part of some type of elite group, in my opinion. You know, you don't have to do 75 hard to make you a better or worse person, but um, doing 75 hard and completing it makes definitely makes you a better person uh, mentally, physically. Uh, emotionally, um, I feel a lot stronger in all those areas. You know, running a business has, takes its toll on you. You know, parenting takes its toll on you. So you add all those things together with life. Uh, it's, it's stressful, but I handle it pretty well. And I've got a great group around me to help me with that too. So, but just want to give you a little update. So, holler at me if you want to do 75 hard. Uh, I've got a couple books floating around here. I'll help you any way I can because I think it will change your life. So, all right, man. Have a good day. Thanks.